This video will take you through the installation of the Netatmo Smart Video Doorbell. It is easy to install in place of an existing wired doorbell. There are just a few simple steps to follow to install the video doorbell. Check that your Chime is compatible with a Smart Video Doorbell. Install the Chime module next to your current Chime. Install the Smart Video Doorbell outside your home. Then complete the installation using the app. The pack contains all the product components required for the installation. One Smart Video Doorbell with a micro SD card. One wall mounting plate. One Chime module. One 25 degree bracket. One drilling template. One finish plate. Two anchors. Two mounting screws. Four bracket screws. One wire connector. And one connector screw. One security screw and its custom tool. One additional fuse. One user guide and one HomeKit card. You will also need the following basic tools. One pencil. One Phillips screwdriver. One level. One drill and one 6mm drill bit. For the installation, you will need a smartphone or tablet and a Wi-Fi network with high-speed internet. Before installing the Smart Video Doorbell, please read the instructions in the user guide carefully. Press your doorbell button to locate your chime. It is usually found near the door or in the switchboard. The Smart Video Doorbell works with most electrical installations. Check the compatibility of your installation via the online test. After verifying the compatibility, use your smartphone to check you have sufficient Wi-Fi signal at the doorbell's location when your door is closed. If you do not, please move your Wi-Fi router. Disconnect power at fuse or circuit breaker before proceeding to the installation. Take the Chime module included in the pack. This module will regulate the power between your Chime and the Smart Video Doorbell. It is therefore essential. If you do not install it, you risk damaging your doorbell system. Remove your Chime cover. You should see two wires connected to your Chime. If you see more than two wires, please visit the Help Center. On your Chime, first loosen one of the screws, then hook one of the Chime module's wires. Please note that there is no polarity in the circuit. You therefore do not need to worry about which wire you choose. Tighten the screw in order to maintain the wires together. Repeat these steps for the second wire. Once the wires are connected and secured, Verify the Chime module configuration. To do so, make sure the selectors are in the 1 low position. Put the Chime cover or switchboard cover back on. Then, stick the Chime module next to your Chime using the two stickers on the back of the module. Make sure power is still disconnected before continuing the installation. Unmount your old doorbell button from the wall and disconnect the wires. Place the drilling template on the wall and pass the wires through the provided space. Next, mark the holes with a pencil. Use a 6mm drill for the holes and insert the two provided anchors. For the next part of the installation, you have two options depending on the layout of your entrance. If you are installing the video doorbell on the wall parallel to your door, fix the wall mounting plate directly to the wall. If you are installing the video doorbell in a corner or near a wall that could restrict the camera's field of view, install the doorbell on the 25 degree bracket provided to change the viewing angle. In the first case, insert the two wires from your old doorbell through the waterproof membrane of the wall mounting plate. Then install the wall mounting plate on the wall using the two mounting screws provided. In the second case, start by installing the 25 degree bracket on the wall using the two mounting screws provided. 
Insert the two wires from your old doorbell through the waterproof membrane of the wall mounting plate. Screw the wall mounting plate to the 25 degree bracket with the four provided bracket screws. You can use the finish plate to hide potential scratches and holes on the wall. From now on, the steps will be the same regardless of the option you selected. Insert and secure the wires into the wire connector. There is no polarity in the circuit, insert the wires in the order you want. Place the wire connector on the wall mounting plate and secure it with a connector screw. Plug the smart video doorbell on the wall mounting plate. Secure the doorbell with the provided security screw. You can now reconnect the power. The smart video doorbell will start and its LED will turn on. If the LED changes from flashing green to solid green and a melody plays, this means the doorbell works with the current chime module configuration. If the LED flashes a different color, you must configure your chime module. If the LED flashes blue, change the selectors to the one high position. If the LED flashes purple, change the selectors to the two low position. After configuring the chime module, regardless of whether your LED was flashing blue or purple, press the doorbell once. After a few seconds, the LED will change from flashing green to solid green. At this point, your chime is not yet activated, so don't worry if you cannot hear it ring. If your smart video doorbell does not light up at all, check the chime module is correctly connected in the chime box. If the LED still does not light up, please visit the Netatmo Help Center. Once the LED glows solid green, press your doorbell to activate your chime and complete the electrical setup. The LED will flash white after a few seconds, indicating that your doorbell is ready to be connected to the app. To complete the installation, download the Netatmo app and follow the instructions on your smartphone or tablet. For more information, please go to netatmo.com. Your Netatmo Smart Video Doorbell is now ready to go.